Hey guys, it's Diego, and today, um, my, I'm making a video where I'm gonna be talking over, like, uh, some of the highlights from yesterday's round. I shot 81, big improvement. I had a lot more one putts yesterday, which is what really kind of helped my score out, because that was my only problem yesterday, I mean, two days ago, but anyways, um, Hope you guys enjoy this new type of format. I'll try to get my dad to come out again to my tournament next week, maybe, so he can video some more shots so I can make another video like this. And uh, I didn't actually vlog this one because we weren't staying there, so that's why there isn't. So we're gonna start it off with uh, this long bunker shot I had. I didn't have too much green to work with, but I did the best of what I could and I actually hit a pretty good shot um, out. I had like a 10 to 12 footer, and my dad actually recorded in slow motion. Um, but as you can see, I made it, which was pretty awesome. I think it was like my first up and down of the day. And next, I have a shot that I really didn't plan to do. I was trying to bump it in the hill, but I didn't hit the way I wanted to. But it worked out really well since I got it pretty close. I didn't have a very good lie and try to flop it on the green, but. I like the way that one turned out. And I tapped in for my par, my second up and down, which is pretty cool. And on this, I actually hit like a really crazy shot. I had to hook a seven iron around some trees. And um, that's a horrible showing of my lag putting ability. And uh, I got the up and down, which is pretty good. Here's like a wedge shot I had on a par five. I hit two pretty good shots. Had about like 50 yards, kind of like a no wrist swing, and um, I got it pretty close. And uh, this is when I started giving myself a lot of birdie opportunities because I shot 37 on this nine. Um, and this was kind of like the story with my putting, with all my birdie putts today, because just burned the edge. And this was actually a really good shot here. I was coming out of the rough. I had about 120, so I had to choke down a pitching wedge and kind of like funk one in there. I struck it really good out of the rough, but it didn't come out with any spin, so it kind of ran out through the green. The longer one on the left. And this is a putt I had. And I, I don't remember what read I had. I think it might have been pretty straight, maybe a little right to left, but as you can see, it just burned the edge and I was pretty upset. And I had another birdie putt here after a really solid eight iron into the wind and uh, I left that one short. And on this shot, I actually um, hit my drive out of bounds because the wind just kept pushing my draw. I had like 187, so I took out a five iron uh, smacked it out of the rough, hit it really good, and I actually had a pretty good putt for par, um, but it was a big right to left swinger, as you can see I'm aiming way to the right on this, and I hit it, I, it looked good all the way, and then just at the end, you can see by my reaction, it didn't go in, it kind of sucked, so I had to tap in for bogey there. On this, it was a long par three, this is about 200, so I took out my four iron, and um, I was actually trying to cut this one uh, with the wind, so it would um, kinda get there, but instead I kinda drew it against the wind, which you'll see here in a second. Uh, look at the right side of the green, over there by that bunker, that's where I landed. Just kind of got stuck in the wind and didn't turn over. And this is my chip. Which is actually pretty good. I had to judge the downhill slope. And left it a little bit short. It's always good when you make the putt come back. And this next hole, camera works kind of bad in this one. I know like, kind of like a little wedge shot on par 5. And um, you can see he kind of panned over the sky and didn't really follow it. But I had this putt for birdie to finish my round and 
finally made one. Let's see about my fist pump. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. Um, never done it before. I mean, I've probably done it in the past, like kind of like my Cottonwood Golf Club video. If you've ever seen that video, it's like the second video I uploaded, or maybe even the first. Um, it's kind of like that, but I talked over the shots and told you what I was trying to do. Speaking of which, I'm actually gonna be uploading like a Twin Creeks Golf Club video. Um, it's a really fun course, I shot 79 there. It was actually recorded last week, I just didn't upload it because I had so many videos that I had already made. Um, so I'm gonna be uploading that too. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed the video, uh, leave a like, comment something down below, and um, yeah, it's me you guys, see you in the next one.